So, we're having celebration. We're yeah. having our shrimp celebration for 20,000 subscribers. Said no fresh shrimp, so we opted for the frozen. I asked him where they're from. He said Ecuador. I said, what? What? Ecuadorian shrimp. He showed me some real small ones. I said, no, I don't want that. They show me these. I said, yeah, we could do that. So I'm just going to defrost them in a little hot water bath here. We're going to make our special American buffalo sauce with the harissa twist. And we're going to have a little veggie, veggie stuff going on too. Not this fun. With whole butter. And we're going to mix it with star sauce picante. Basically harissa. It's harissa. So we are mixing harissa and butter. Low heat, don't burn it. So we are making two kind of shrimp sauces, right? And barbecue. Mm -hmm. Buffalo shrimp. It's gonna be real good. And then probably something more parsley, olive oil. Not as fun and exciting. It's nice, huh? So nice. Uh, we got like, like Trying to get the shwaya going. Barbecue. That's what they call it, Shweya? Shweya. Shweya. Mixing of the buffalo sauce and the shrimp here. I'd like to see them a little bit more coated, but we, we used all the butter. German engineering. Just building a little tower. Thank you. Thanks, Felix. Looking good. Nice I think one. we can even put more in there. No? I think it's pretty good. Is it half so we can have half half? It's kind of like half. Yeah, it looks pretty good. Pretty good? Yeah. Seal them up for their barbecue journey. Just putting some shrimps on there like this. Just gonna hit it like that. Yep. Check out this sunset. Wow. Kevin, what's going on over here? Well, we're removing the shrimps from the barbecue. We reckon they're done. They smell like it. They've been on there about 20 minutes. Yes, they confirm the smell is great. And it looks great. It's looking pretty good, huh? Not as soupy as the last time we did no, these. No, I think but... because we cooked them for a while, but they're going to be really good. There's lots of butter on there. Yeah, they're, they're going to be good. And butter. Well, yeah, we'll just let them set a little bit. Yeah. Um, last time we had leeks and parsley, and that adds a lot of moisture and nice soupiness to it. So... Next time we're gonna get some real vegetables in there, not just harissa and yeah, butter. Huh? What's going on over there, Andrea? So we have second part of shrimps. Yep. And right now I'm cutting garlic, cutting, and then we're gonna the garlic, and we're the gonna shrimp. add some parsley, olive oil, salt, maybe pepper. Got another one here. First yeah. try. First try for shrimp. Just gonna quickly peel it. That's all right, that's all right. Okay. Spicy, juicy, perfect shrimp. All the way from Ecuador to a German's mouth in Morocco. They're from Ecuador? From Ecuador. Really? Yeah. Wow, I thought they caught them here. No, 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 far, far away. Mm. Shadow. We're going to put it right into the aluminum now. Yeah, so get we have it in there. Chili sauce in the bottom. Wow, that looks yummy. We have um, olive oil, lime juice, garlic, parsley, uh, salt and pepper, and one ingredient. And I don't know if I can tell it. It's uh, haram. You put it's some white wine in there. Yeah. Wow. Dude, they're gonna be salty, man. No, no, it's good. It's good. It's good. They come from the sea. 
Okay, put the sauce on there. Ooh, just pour it on it. Wow, I think we got enough sauce. Yeah, we got enough sauce. Cover that up, cover that up. Okay, I'm just done for me. Here we go. Make a measure here, boys. German, <laughs> what do we call it? German organization, engineering. Engineering. This is so much different than I did, and man. You know, I just roll it up the sides and just cover it. Let's get it rolling. It's time to go. You're hungry. Thought the mook thing was going on tonight, but it's not. Ah, look at that cover. Perfect. Good enough. Thanks to your motto at work at the pool. Good enough. All right, now we put the top on it. Don't squeeze it. You know, gentle, gentle, good. And now just stick it right to the fire. All right, two dudes and some shrimps here. Buffalo shrimp from Ecuador. Let's, let's go for it. this. And Andrea, you can join oh, in us over started. here. Okay. Get over here. Wow, they look amazing. Oh wow, it smells amazing. Brett. Dude, this is so good. Felix approves. Ecuadorian shrimp. I think that we could have cooked them for a little bit less. Yeah. Because now they're too hard? I mean, they're super delicious, but... Yeah. Would have been... Okay. They are very meaty. Yeah. See the unveiling of... But you will like this more, I think. Andrea's shrimp here. Yeah. Okay, okay. But it's Italian style, yeah? Well, these so these look, out. They look, they look these better. Look, these look better, yeah. These look better. Let's see if they taste better. Look at that. Ooh. Okay, who's gonna have bird bite? Felix. <laughs> <laughs> Head juice. Me, I prefer these ones. Really? Thank you, Felix. I'll have to try myself. See, of course. <laughs> Only because they were cooked less. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> Excuse me, we're gonna cut this out. Oh. All the empty shells totally destroyed those shrimps. Very good buffalo style. Felix says best sauce with just two ingredients. Harissa, Zipta. Sorry. Cheetah does not like the sun.